welcome viewers if still you're not subscribed to this channel kindly subscribe and also click the bell icon to get technology updates regularly on this jp infotech channel hi in this video we are going to see about a python project which is entitled as soil analysis and crop recommendation using machine learning which is an ieee 2022 conference paper so before seeing the execution of the project let me brief about this project agriculture is one of the important sector to many of the countries and especially countries like india mainly depend on the agriculture but indian farmers has many problems in this agriculture and one of the problem is like finding the suitable crop or the profitable crop based on their soil because india has various types of soil types so in this project the authors are implementing the machine learning algorithm into this problem so here the soil is been analyzed and the crop recommendation is been given to the farmers using the machine learning algorithm and the authors have used the cnn and random forest model but we are not going to use the same as mentioned in the base paper and we are going to use our proposed algorithm or model as mobile net v2 architecture for this soil analysis and crop recommendation using machine learning project and the training accuracy that we have achieved is 97.34 percentage and the validation the accuracy that we have achieved is 99.21 percentage so now in this project the uh, the former or the entity will be uploading their soil type and it will be predicting what type of soil and it will be recommending the crops accordingly and this will be the flow of the project so let me show you the data set so in the model file you can find the test and train folders there you can find the train you can see the four classification of the soil that is alluvial soil black soil clay soil and red soil and in alluvial soil you can find these images so these are the data set for the alluvial soil that we are going to train up the system with and then comes the black soil where you can find the data set images for the black soil and next comes the clay soil where you can find the data set images for the clay soil and it comes the red soil where you can find the data set images for the red soil so these are the data set that we are going to train up the system for the soil classification crop recommendation and now let us see the execution of the project before executing make sure that you are satisfied the requirement that is mentioned in the requirements file by installing the exact version of python on the libraries that is mentioned in the requirements file and now you can copy the source code location go to your command prompt now go to the source code location type python app.py and click enter and kindly wait for few minutes and now you can find this url just copy this url <coughs> go to any of your browser i'm going to firefox and just paste the url and click enter and now you can find the home screen or welcome screen of the project with the project title soil analysis and crop recommendation using machine learning now just click this login menu and now it will be navigated to the login page where you can find the username and password and kindly note that this is a static login page because we have not used any database in the project so just enter the default username and password as admin and admin and then click this login button 
and once the login is successful you can see this login success message and click ok and now it will be navigated to the preview part where you need to upload the test image to find the prediction result and whether it is what kind of soil type and also the crop recommendation according to the soil so let me click this browse button now go to the project source code location where you can find the upload folder where you can see the few test cases for the each case of the classification alluvial soil black soil clay soil red soil so first let me go to the alluvial soil and let me select an image and this is the image that I have select and let me click the submit button and now you can see the prediction result is alluvial soil and the crop recommended for this is this soil is suitable for the crops like rice wheat sugarcane maize cotton soya bean jute and this is the crop recommended for this soil type and to predict an another case just click this preview menu again and now let me select the browse button and let me go to the other classification black soil let me select an image from the data set and then click submit and now you can see the predicted result is black soil and what is the crop recommended is this soil is suitable for the crops Virginia wheat jover millets linseed castor and sunflower and these are the suitable crops for this black soil and now let me click the preview menu again and now let me go to the next classification that clay soil and let me select an image from the clay soil and click the submit button and now you can see the prediction result is clay soil and this soil is suitable for the crops like rice, lettuce, chard, broccoli, cabbage, snap beans and this is the recommended crop for this clay soil and now let me go to the preview menu again let me click the browse and then go to the final case that is red soil and let me select an image for this red soil and then click submit and now the predicted result is red soil and the crop recommended for this soil is cotton wheat pulses millets oil seeds and potatoes so i have shown you a few cases from the test cases and you can check with the test cases or the train data set that we have used for it so let me select a random one instead of selecting the test cases so let me go to the model folder and go to the train folder so let me select a image from a random part so let me select this one and then click the submit button and now you can see the printed result is alluvial soil and the, this soil is suitable for the crops like rice wheat sugar can maize cotton and soya bean and let me download an image from the google and test it so let me download an image so let me download red soil image so let me download this image and save image as red one let me check for the alluvial soil images let me download this save image as alluvial soil 1 so let me check for these two and kindly note that there are some limitations because you that, that may file size will be different or file type may be different so kindly check those things and then upload it and now let me go to the preview part and now let me select the browse and go to the desktop where i have downloaded the red soil and let me check the prediction result by this by clicking the submit button and you can see the predicted result is red soil it has predicted correctly and it has been recommending the crops for that red soil 
and now let me go to the preview button again and click the browse let me go for this alluvial soil and then click the summit and now you can see the predicted result is alluvial soil this soil is suitable for the crops and wheat rice wheat sugar can maize cotton soya bean jute and this is being shown here and there may be a doubt like it is predicting based on the name so let me save some other name and check it out so now let me go for a black soil images and let me save this image as testing new today let me save a different name for this and now let me go to the preview menu and now let me upload this by selecting the browse button testing new today and let me click the submit button and now you can see the predicted result is black soil and the, the recommended crop for this is virginia wheat jover millets linseed castor and sunflower and in this way you can check with the test data and the train data set images and now let me go to the performance analysis part where you can see the performance analysis parameters like accuracy precision value recall value and f measure value and then comes the confusion matrix with the true and the predicted label for the alluvial soil black soil clay soil and red soil and final comes the chart part and kindly note that this is a static chart as i intimated earlier this project does not contain any database to show dynamic graph so just we have been depicted the chart from the data set that we have trained up with which consists of 30.8 percentage of alluvial soil image and 19.2 black soil image and 30.8 clay soil image and 19.2 red soil image data set and now let me log out and this is all about the project soil analysis and crop recommendation using machine learning and thank you all for watching